question we have is a question of channel 22 garage for the van. Excellent. Yes, uh, the board had requested me to look into this problem and see whether or not we could build a garage out and back mm -hmm. using the Channel 22 funds to, to store that van indoors so it'll be protected. And I will preface my further remarks by saying that the prior van we had were broken, was broken into at least twice, which means that we have to take everything out of the van and bring it in the building when it's not in use and then take it back out every time we need mm -hmm. to use the van. Uh, we have a proposal that the building department obtained for me, a, an estimate. Um, the estimate is $44,752.30. That includes a, uh, uh, the erection of the, uh, the foundation, uh, which will be a monolithic slab, and the erection of the, uh, the structure itself, uh, the insulation, electrical work, and, and uh, heating that needs to be put in the building, um, which is very minimal, and um, painting, interior finishes, uh, landscaping, um, drywall, and the uh, cement floor sealant, so the cement floor is protected. Uh, how does the board want me to proceed from this point? We now have an estimate. We can start working forward with something that the board wishes us to. Mr. Chairman, I will move that we implement the manager's plan. We can't keep losing, uh, losing valuable equipment. Does have a security system, Fred, for it? We can do that. We actually we can put a camera right up off the back Excellent. of the building. Excellent. Excellent. I'm just reading this. That it says the exclusion yeah. are all landscaping, interior yep. finish, right. painting, insulation, yep. drywall, the interior work, yep. finish, is, interior work. That's is not it? included in that's this. Correct. It's just a basic. Basic shell. building. Right. Yep. Basic shell with uh, minimal electrical, but I agree that if we're going to have electrical in there, we probably should have some sort of. Yep. It should be attached to the alarm here or. Yes, it should. Yes. Yep. I'll second it. Yes. I'm fine with it, but I have a question about how much money do we. We have plenty of money in the. This would come from the cable committee fund, right? Yeah, Correct. Right. We have several hundred thousand dollars in there. Yep. I have a. Yes. If I may raise my hand before I talk. Uh, <laughs> is this a legitimate taking out of the fund? Yes. Okay. This is solely so. for the Channel 22. It's solely for their van and solely mm -hmm. for its protection. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Can't use it for anything else, and I think everybody needs to be appraised of that. This cannot be used for something else. Good. I will be fine to agree to this motion made, but I just, at some point, um, I was talking to my Channel 22 constituent, as I do not have Channel 22 at home because I, don't, I have DirecTV. And she was telling me that um, she's nervous because it seems like all, all the cable funds, now correct me if I'm wrong, come from people that actually have Comcast for cable. So if you have internet, you don't pay it. So there seems to be a lot less people now in town from what I'm hearing that have cable. Comcast because, well, I have it for internet and I can understand why they're not happy and they're leaving and there's other alternatives, dark TV, satellite, stuff like that. But at some point in time, will the Cable Advisory Committee be looking at the difference between the amount of people that actually have cable now compared to what they used to and how much we're taking in as a town for revenue? Rusty? Yeah. Yeah, the, ca the, the, the Cable Renewal Committee this currently has a survey being being built up by mm -hmm. the Rockingham Planning Commission, which will be online right. and will be also a hard copy so people can look at it. And we will get the opinion of the people. We also Perfect. will get a number of people that are doing it. And I agree with you 100%. Right. There are fewer and fewer and fewer. Cable probably going to go out the window at some point. Yeah. And that, that's, a, that's a valid point that that's going to change everything in the way it's done. And, and yes, we will be looking into that. All right, thank you very much. No, so I'd like to uh, point out too, I don't even have direct TV. I just have the uh, antenna. It works wonderful. That, yeah. And now, Alexa, I just have to tell her to put net, uh, Netflix <laughs> on. It happens. It's so easy. I can't imagine what, how they'll be in business in a couple more years. <clears throat> right. Uh, so right now we have a motion on the floor right. to, to approve the spending of $45,000 $45, out of the cable fund, of the cable fund 
for the installation of a building out back here that is specifically for the cable committee and the cable van. To secure the van. To secure the van. You I'll might as well do it before they uh, isn't the money there. Is there a motion, a second? All those in favor? Unanimous. Okay. Thank you, Fred. Good job. Thank on that. you.